Hi, and welcome back to the Mr. Brad Warden Show. And unfortunately, I've been under, a little bit under the weather lately, so I haven't been in action yesterday, and I was considering whether I should be today or not, but maybe the sinus stuff going on, maybe this will help actually clear me out a little bit. So, um, just real quick here on the product of the day. Uh, it is a hot sauce, and usually I don't just like to do hot sauces, just do hot sauces. I like to find the hottest ones. So this one um, comes from um, the beef jerky outlet I found it at. And instead of just picking up any old hot sauce, I always go to the person working there and ask them, what is your hottest hot sauce you have, just to try it out? Well, he recommended this one. It's C.A. John's brand, which is famous for some of their hot sauces. You can check out C.A. John's and they got all kinds of stuff. They came out with a newer line called Kaboom. And there were three different ones sitting on the shelf there, all in order. And I'm like, well, which one's the hottest one? Well, it's the Kaboom Ballistic. And it comes with a cool little Kaboom keychain, which I'll have to cut off before I get started. And the reason what makes this so hot is there's a nice blend of uh, seasoning and peppers in there. But then if you read the label, it says that there is 4 million Scoville unit extract in here. Which probably puts this probably close to the top 10 hot sauces in the world right now. Um, obviously, Mad Dog Plutonium 9 is number one at 9 million, but then there's very few that are up there. I mean, 4 million is going to be probably around the top 10 right now. Um, it says, this is no ordinary hot sauce. Kaboom is loaded with heat extracted to concentrated form and specifically blended to destroy your targeted heat receptor taste buds. It won't kill you, but you may wish that it did. Um... So here's the hot sauce. Um, I'm not sure exactly how much I want to do. I have my sauce tasting spoon out here. I'm not sure if I'm going to fill it up all the way at first. Uh, kind of see where this goes. Oh, here goes that. So here's my cool little... Um, it's got like a bottle opener on it. My Kaboom keychain that came with my hot sauce. So I'll keep that. And then it's sealed. I haven't tried this yet. So see me trap for the first time obviously if you're a regular person watching at home and you got a sauce such as this this is meant to go on food and it's meant to be used in drops on food in a food like chilies tacos whatever have you so obviously me being a chili head i go a little bit overboard and eat it straight um but most normal people would not want to do this. This is with 4 million. Extract is probably going to be a 10 for an average person. And for Chili Head, I'll let you know pretty quick. So this is Kaboom Ballistic Hot Sauce from C.A. John's. <clears throat> oh, my sinuses are so stuffy. Maybe this will clear me out of it. Hmm. It smells like your average, like, Pretty high heat hot sauce. So we'll see here how much I want to go. Maybe even drops. I had about 14 drops in there. It's about a quarter of a spoon here. Um, not sure. Should I go for a little bit more? Ah, uh, yep, my camera person shaking her head yes. Alright, I'll go like, well, we'll do like half a spoon Why don't we go there and hopefully I don't pay for this. Maybe it'll clear me out a little bit. It's probably about, probably about two dozen drops. Yeah, we're like a little over halfway full here now. Um, all right, well, let's give this a shot and see what it does for me. Oh yeah, 
that's kicking in. Definitely a 10 for an average person, like I said. Um, let it settle a little bit. I'm gonna swallow this quick. Let's just get a couple more drops here for tongue's sakes. <clears throat> It's got, um, it tastes similar to some of the League of Fire Chug Challenges, similar, um, kind of interesting, maybe like the standard League of Fire Chug Challenge, it has a very similar flavor because it has some of the hot extract in it, some of the similar, similar flavors, mm-hmm. Fruit, papaya, vinegar, tomato paste, mustard, um, pineapple too. Some interesting flavors in there. Um, obviously it burns my mouth, burns my um, lips where it touched, burns in my throat. I would say probably. Um, a three to four for a chili head, not like super unbearable, but hot enough where you get a nice burn from it. Obviously, like I said, if you're an average person trying this and you like, um, the C.A. John's, they do have tons of hot sauces at lesser heat than obviously this. This is one of the probably top ones from that company. If you were going to use something like this and you're an average person, you'd probably just want to add like one or two drops to a a food product like a chili or a taco or something like that. Um, obviously, it's pretty good. Um, I definitely keep this to use it in some of my foods and products and maybe other challenges of sort. So anyway, that's it. Um, hopefully, I'm feeling a little bit better soon. Um, might have to check out the um, a few places again upcoming. Um, I do have one more League of Fire challenge um, waiting for me, so that'll be coming up sooner or later. Um, I think I moved up a little bit. Uh, I made top 25 in League of Fire now. I think I'm sitting at 23rd, I want to say. Um, for the year or two, they have a year chart. I am in the top 20 for the year, so... That's pretty good. I'll keep trying to move up there too. And uh, have a good night, and we will see you later on the Mr. Bradward Show.